running a, a good three and a half miles of walking in the next couple of days. <laughs> Steve's forgotten his big coat. His waterproof, windproof, rainproof, everything proof coat. So he's gone inside to see if he can find another one. We are off on the epicness. We've had absolutely no hiccups whatsoever so far. <laughs> Apart from a minor critical waterproof jacket scenario, which co-op has sold for us. And we also had a, a directional issue with modern technology that doesn't work so we were resorted to a £1.25 plastic compass which yes. told us we were going in completely the wrong direction but other than that this is the start of the epicness and you can see already the tops are already shrouded in cloud we're going there somehow Colin's already elected to put his waterproofing on his rucksack I just think that's the glass is half empty rather than the glass half full personally <laughs> here is the reason why the Lake District is misty all the time. Oh! <laughs> Fucking chances, look at that! I mean this is rock climbing! <laughs> it's a bit of freaking sheep shit! I could take some great pictures of it. <laughs> and you just ring your gloves out. And it's slippy because it's wet. Some might call this hell. Some call this paradise. Right then. We're at the top of something. <laughs> Somewhere. We can't go any higher. We can't go any higher physically. That's why it's blowing at about 90 miles an hour. It's pretty breezy. So we're going lower. Pitch tents. Pitch tents and have some wine! Yay, so we can get dry! Yeah. What are you cooking? Chips? <laughs> 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 it looks like chips from here. Pasta. Pasta, brilliant. Uh, it's time for refreshing Campo Viego Reserva 2009 Grand Reserva. Very nice. So, currently on top of a mountain. Had a hairy moment earlier where we thought we were lost. Or, well, should I say, we were lost. Um, and Steve kept finding every hole, uh, and he fell down that a few times. I laughed that much that I fell down the same hole about four times when setting my tent up, so that's divine retribution. Um, and <laughs> he's laughing in tent. And um, and then the, the the latest thing to happen was uh, <laughs> Steve and I can't stop laughing. Uh, spill his wine. <laughs> he spill his wine um, in his tent. So uh, not only is all his clothes wet with the rainwater, it's also um, stinky and it smells like a brewery. Okay, oh yeah, I didn't bring a wine glass. So. Um, just as nice, it's a bit chilly, a bit too cold, but you can't be over middle class in a tent on the fell. Oh, is that, is that a break in the cloud above? We've been in bed now for a while and it's uh, half past eight, <laughs> half past eight at night. Again. Yes? That way, Mr. Smacker! We climbed up that solid rock face! We did, didn't we? Literally! We did mountaineering! It's all on video! Steve, bend it over. No? With both Ragnar's cameras out, checking it, digging it!
Right now there's no wind, the GoPro can probably hear us, but the other side of that fell there was our mountain rescue climb that we did. Accidentally. A path! It's a path! So we both fell. Nil. Colin and Steve won. I like to eat from the I like to eat from the earth. Yeah, it's one with nature. Yeah, you could probably still eat some of that, but <laughs> it's rock hard. <laughs> I can hear it crunching. <laughs> and we can see the farm that we started at the epic scenery that, that is that fell over there. <laughs> Something else. Steve's doing well behind, give us a wave. Yeah. Still alive, still alive. This is where we went wrong and why we had to uh, bring the mountain to Mohammed uh. because the right is up to Bofell on the path which is so well signposted it's frank yeah look at all the signposts that tells you that it's Bofell yeah uh. nothing the road, we took. the road of certain doom. certain doom and that's the one that we took ended up that massive crack up there we lit, I cannot believe again that we absolutely spanked that. 